Hi guys, welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about how to enable the new small taskbar icons in the latest builds from the dev and the beta channels of the Windows Insider program. And of course, this will work on builds 26120.3671 from the beta channel and 26200.5518 from the dev channel or above, of course. In this video, as always, I'm going to show you how to enable it, how it works and how it looks in the latest builds from the dev and the beta channels in Windows 11. So if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. Of course, first of all, we're going to have to set up VivTool on our computer. Just make sure to get VivTool from the article below in the video description and then just get it for the platform that you have. In my case, it is Intel or AMD. I'm just going to get it and then I'm going to open it using File Explorer. After it is opened in File Explorer, click on Extract All, click on Browse and make sure you extract it into a dedicated folder. In my case, I'm going to extract it in Local Disk C. And I'm going to create here a new folder which will be called hidden features select the folder of course click on select and then you should also copy the location because we're gonna need it whenever we are running the commands i'm gonna click on extract and then this is how you successfully and easily set a vive tool on your computer now all you need to do is to open up the cmd as administrator type in the search box cmd and then click on run as administrator on user account control of course click on yes first of all inside cmd type in cd and then paste the location where you extracted vive tool and then you're gonna have to use two different commands so that you're sure that the new taskbar or small icons or small buttons will work. First of all, we have the main ID, which is 29785184, which is the one for this feature. And additionally, we have the ID 48433719, which is basically the ID for all the main new features inside these builds. A huge shout out to Phantom of Earth on Twitter or x.com for providing the IDs and information about these new features. We're going to have his Twitter link in the pinned comment below. After everything is done, you should also receive the message successfully set feature configuration after each command. Don't forget that also all these commands will be in the article below so you can just copy and paste them from there and after that just exit out from the cmd and make sure you restart your computer for the changes to take effect after the restart whenever you right click on the taskbar then go to taskbar settings and then scroll down to taskbar behaviors at the bottom you're going to see this new option show smaller taskbar buttons and you have three different options when taskbar is full never or always if you select always it will automatically turn the taskbar icons or buttons to small as you can see this is how it looks and it also works in combination with the combined taskbar buttons and hide labels option if you select it on never you're going to see that the taskbar buttons or icons will still be small in my opinion this new feature is a pretty nice new one but hopefully microsoft will go the extra mile and let us enable the small taskbar which is a feature that has been requested from users since the beginning of windows 11 and hopefully microsoft will finally listen to its users and allow us to enable that as well alongside with maybe moving the taskbar around the screen that would be a big bonus but as i said this is working in in combination with this setting and you can also select when taskbar is full and basically whenever you have the taskbar full with icons then the taskbar buttons will turn too small but i think it's a pretty nice new addition and of course let me show you how it looks with multiple apps open i'm going to open paint i'm going to open notepad i'm going to open the file explorer basically this is how it looks in the taskbar whenever you have this enabled of course it is very easy to enable set a vive tool run those two commands do a restart and you should be good to go on the latest builds from the dev and the beta channels of the Windows Insider program. So basically, this is the video for today. I hope you liked it. If you did, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.